Hi guys! Welcome back to the channel. It started to rain, but empowering too. And for this video, we are discussing the Body Shop's Lip and Cheek Stain in, I think this is the shade... What shade is this? I forgot. Pink Hibiscus. So I already have the red pomegranate one, which is said to be Emma Watson's favorite. But I just had to get another one because they were on sale like buy one get one or buy two for like certain percentage off. So I got two. Now, this is actually one of the OG lip and cheek tints. Like super way back in the day, early 2000s. And even before maybe. But I first encountered this early 2000s and it wasn't even packaged in this uh, packaging yet. It was a different, longer tube then. And, just a tidbit, when I first got it, it was as old as this. Well, first got it together with this Body Shop foundation brush. So this is a really old brush. Again, early 2000s, and it, it, it's what now? 2022. So, the SA told me that if I wanted to neatly apply the lip and cheek uh, stain, on my cheeks, I should use this um, brush. And I was such a newbie then, but honestly, this has been one of my go-to brushes for like lip and cheek stains, and also for foundation in general. This is a good brush, and it, it has held up really, really well, considering how much use it has taken for me and how long I've had it. So yeah, just a quick tip from the Body Shop SA. So this is Pink Hibiscus again, and let's try it out to bring some warmth and rosiness to this look. So there's again, there's a seal, because we're still doing this as part of January. And I broke the seal now. So how do you use it? You basically apply like, I'll try two dots first because I don't know how pigmented this is. So can you see that? Looks so nice with color it's Jordan. This is what I use in the for the contour and bronzer. Can you see it? I think I have to apply more just for the sake of the video. So there. There's a few more. This is my shade, I feel. Red pomegranate is a reddish orange shade that doesn't really look as good as this one so a word to the wise emma watson is not the same color as you are <laughs> so nice can you hear my son in the background he just woke up so i'm trying to rush this already so we can play and have Brianda. So nice. This is really my shade. I'll, I'll see if I can like compare it with the red pomegranate just so you can see. But let me finish applying this for first impressions. I really like this shade on me. And it's very buildable. It has decent pigmentation. Well, you have to build it up, but I guess it's a good thing because it's beginner friendly as well. You don't go in and like have patches of super pigment on your face. Let's try it on the lips first before I get um, red pomegranate. So this is just my issue with stains. Kinda doesn't cover my lips evenly but if you're going for a really natural look this is a good one i think i applied way too much i should have stopped at first pass for the lips this is a bit too pink now but yeah i'm really liking this looks good so let me just get um, red pomegranate. So I have the two shades now here, and it retails for $795 each at regular price, but they go on sale, so just watch out for it. 
So this is um, pink hibiscus. Oh, I still have the brown. Wait, let me remove it. Here you go. Removed it. I forgot to remove it earlier. So this is pink hibiscus. See that? And then let's swatch red pomegranate, which is Emma Watson's shade. Maybe I'll do a separate video for this so that you guys can see it on. See, it's a reddish orange kind of shade. So I feel like the pink hibiscus one goes better. Maybe you can combine them. Do you want me to combine them? I'll try to combine them on the lips. You know, the two-tone effect. Hmm, I'm liking it. Changed color instantly. So yeah, that's my quick new first impression. So the Body Shop Lip and Cheek Stain in Pink Hibiscus. Another really good multi-use product. Thank you guys for watching. See you again next time. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already. Stay safe. Bye.